Ahoy mates, and welcome to another episode of my Blind Bag Ship series. We're in our two six surprises, and we load them into the Jolly Roger to open. So first up, this little guy is looking at me in back. We have a Cats vs. Pickles. Oh, these are the hard little mystery figures. That's cute. I, I love the pickles. <laughs> then I have a little Squishmallow blind bag with one little mini guy inside. And then on this side, let's grab our Mamiji, I believe it's called. And this is the reading series, the bookshop. That is adorable. Lots of fun stuff. There's so many fun blind bags out. Okay, so then down here, let's grab our Star Wars Micro Force from Series 3. We got two more items. Over here, I have a little remint. This is a Sumiko Garashi keychain series. That's cute. <laughs> and then one more item on this side. I have a Smushy Mushy Series 5 a little blind container. Everything's loaded into the Jolly Roger. I have Blooper in our captain. So, oh, I'm excited for this one. We have a lot of good stuff. Let's grab our Star Wars little blind bag, which is precariously balanced on that sale there. So this is Series 3, and I'm really interested in some of the characters. Oh, we have a little Jawa. <laughs> They're cute. But these are fun little Star Wars minifigures. So mm, let's grab the checklist just in case. Oh, that's fun. I like the Sand Trooper too. So I would like the Jawa. And they have some cool um, Rogue One characters as well. So first up, oh, we have this guy. He is a clone commander, Cody. Oh, he has a name. <laughs> so that's cool. Very cool. I'm not sure if he's from the Clone Wars cartoon. And then... Oh, we have, is that, um, yeah, this is Poe. <laughs> Poe Dameron, which looks like, I don't know, that jacket looks like the first movie, perhaps, for, or Force Awakens, that, that version, <laughs> that trilogy. Next up, let's grab our little Squishmallows blind bag. These are the little Squishville minis. Super cute. I, oh, look at the hippo. I also found these at Five Below. Seeing that Walmart in capsule form. Oh, how cute. We have this white little kitty. Isn't she adorable? Or he, the little pink nose and whiskers. Oh, and the ears are super soft. So these aren't as as gushy as regular Squishmallows, but they, they did a pretty good job for such a little mini plushie. Oh, she's really cute and new to my collection as well. Wow, the ears are just so soft. That's adorable. Next up, I have our Remint Blind Box. This is a Sweets Mascot series with Samiku Garashi characters. These are sort of Japanese desserts, which is really cute. Look at the, the mochi one. Okay, so this is an older series too. Let's see what we have inside. That was really hard to open. And oh my goodness, we have Tokagi and his snail buddy. Yes, he's my favorite. So it's just the candy. The snail's a sucker. Okay, that's really cute. Let's get these out. So you loop them through the ball chain and they make two little charms, but I'm just so impressed by the minifigures. I love his little snail buddy. Look at that cute face. And then Tokagi himself is textured. I guess he's sort of like a hard candy there. So cute. Look at his little spikes. <laughs> they did a great job. And even the snail has like a pearlescent coating to it. Super cute. And you could always unscrew the eye pin and use them also as minifigures. Okay, on this side of our ship here, we have a Smushy Mushy from Series 5. These are the adorable little besties. I guess we'll get one of the sweeties in this container. And, oh, fun! We have the little chocolate bar. Look at how cute. And I love the, oh, the cheeks. He comes with a ball chain. And he's a flatter Smushy Mushy, so he's not too squishy. But he still is a cute little mini food item, and he's adorable. And just like that, we're down to two more items. Let's grab our Momiji blind box. These are made by Pop Mart, which have super quality figures. And this is the bookshop, which they're all themed to different genres for books and literature. Look at the little Hamlet one. I just think this is super creative and whimsical, and I absolutely love reading. Mini Toy Love's a hobby, Disneyland's a hobby, and reading's up there too with, with my free time and, and hobbies. So I would really love The Wolf, which is horror. 
I guess it's a werewolf or the Theodore Theater for, <laughs> for Shakespeare. Okay, so we have our blender. Oh, it's small. A smaller one. And inside, oh, cute. This must be the little astronomy one. So this is Sienna Space. Okay, look at the little planet. That's funny. I actually really love reading astronomy and physics. Um, that is awesome. That is... <laughs> That is so cool. And there's so many cool books out. Oh, she comes with some stuff. Oh my goodness, we're not done. We have some accessories. We have one of those packets, do not eat. And then here we go, here's her little card and she's gonna hold a little space sign there. And she says, I like fruitcake and gamma rays, once upon a shooting star. Very cool. And here is Sienna Space, all put together with her accessories, and how cute is that? She's able to hold both of these, and there's the space book. And then this kind of sits on like a hat, which is cool because you can, you know, you can tilt it depending on how, how your orbit goes. I think that's precious. She has her eyes closed. So exciting, and the Webb Telescope had launched, what, Christmas Eve, I believe? So that's going to be awesome to see what new discoveries in astronomy that the future holds for us. I'm super excited to, to see that play out. Yay, so cute. And then last up for this video, I have a Cats vs. Pickle mystery mini figure. So these are hard plastic figures, not plushies. And you can cut the bag to make a cute little hand puppet, which that's kind of adorable. And all your favorite little beanbag plushies, um, I think from the first series or so, are available now as minifigures, so we can, oh, it's a big figure. So inside, there's the, the checklist. We have a green base. Oh, does that mean we got a pickle? <laughs> you know I'm team pickle. <laughs> okay, so I'll put our base there, and let's first take a look at all the different characters. Oh, look at the snow cats there, and bur the cheeseburger cat. Cute. So I don't know if they're straight up from series one. Um, there's been so many. Oh, you can get four different pickles, but they're super cute. And they're pretty big for, for a minifigure. Okay. Oh, that's cute too. Okay, so let's see. Oh, yes, it's a pickle! <laughs> okay, so maybe a green base does mean a pickle. This is Hank. I don't have Hank as a plushie. Hi, Hank. Aren't you adorable? Look at his little pickle body. And then he just snaps right into the base. Oh wow, that's fun. That is so, so cute. I love these. They're, again, a very solid plastic. They're not hollow. And they're just a fun time. I also found that at Five and Below. And you can use the bag as a finger puppet. And I realize now that's Hank. Oh, Hank is our finger puppet. And he like taped cat ears to him. Okay, that and paws. That is too cute. These are so fun. <laughs> Here's something to look at all our fun surprises we opened today. You guys will have to let me know which was your favorite one. Feel free to leave me a comment down below. As for me, ooh, this is a hard choice. I really love Sienna Space, our little astronomy book figure. Samika Garashi is adorable, but I think the pickle wins out. I gotta choose Hank, because he's hilarious. And I love the pickles. So that'll do it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up. And I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope to see you next time. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.